Hey guys, it's Kai with Midtown Auto Center, and today I'm showing you guys a 2014 Honda Ridgeline. It's a sport edition. It has 77,000 miles in a 3.5 liter V6. As you guys can see, it's all blacked out. It looks amazing, except for the rims. You got a dual color going on right there. You also got some blacked out running boards along the side. A beautiful looking front end with the sport logo right there. Look at this thing. It just looks so sporty and aggressive. I love it. Making our way around. You guys can see you got a bit of like a diffuser or something around the bottom. Or maybe they're just mud flaps and I'm crazy. As we walk around, the body, it just looks amazing. Got a good looking truck right here. It's all blacked out as you guys can see, or mostly except for the tires. We'll get on those in a second. You got some red calipers, which is really nice. Gives it a bit of color. You got these nice tires right here. Got a whole bit of tread right there. Nice and meaty. They're sitting on some 245, 60 tires. We got some 18 inch rims as well. And making our way to the back, you got a five foot bed. I almost said five inch. You got a backup camera right there, as well as a little tow, um, tow hitch right there. As you guys can see, you got a nice little bar right there just to organize your cargo. You also have this little cargo space right here. You open up, you got your spare tire, good bit of cargo. You can have the beers and stuff chilling here and the cops won't know. And you got a car jack. You also got these cool looking lights that turn on whenever you open that up. Just so good. And you got the American flag right there, America. Of course, this car is four wheel drive, as you guys can see by the badges. And this side is just as good looking. Now we're going to take a look at the rear seats from this side, but first I'm going to just show you guys what this side looks like. You guys got a little peek at the beginning, but just wanted to show you guys the body looks good. You got some flared fenders as well. And as we make inside, I, I'm, I'm sure you guys noticed the tinted windows. Sorry, Kai EXE stopped working there for a second. You got lights right there, a good looking door design. You got powered doors. You also got this cool cup holder design right there. Lifting the seats, you got a good bit of cargo space down there. You can lift both seats and just open up a whole lot of space. You also got little cargo maps around or map holders in the back, a 12 volt outlet and some climate vents. And then let's go take a look around. You also got a sunroof and I'll show you guys that in a second. Let's drive into the cockpit right here, or drive. Let's get into the cockpit. As you guys can see, you got a cool looking gauge cluster. When you turn it on, get the well-known Honda Charm. You got 77,903 miles. Got a cool looking gauge cluster, as I said. You also have powered windows and you got powered locks and mirrors, of course. Got all these little latches right here, nice and organized. Looks really good. You got your shifter right there. You got cruise control on the right. You got your audio and voice controls on the left. There's your little stereo system, as you guys can see. Looks really good. Got your power button and all your controls right there, as well as your climate control, which is really nice. Two 12 volt outlets. Tons of cubbies all around, as you guys can see. Lots of space, lots of storage. You also have this little cubby down here. You pull this and you can expand, which is pretty cool. You've got two cup holders in the center. You've got this cool glove box, as well as a little aux port right there. It'll focus. There you go. Then your sunroof looks really good. I think it's tinted as well because it's pretty dark. Got your sunroof controls right there as well as your shade holder right there. Then let's go take a look at the engine bay. Now I apologize if it didn't look as clean on the inside. I'm still working on it. Just had to show you guys the video. And here's the 3.5 liter V6. It's been well taken care of and well maintained. Now, give us a call at 513-420-0000 for more information on this vehicle. Or you guys can go to our website at superlowmiles.com. You guys can check out some more photos and videos. I'll probably update it once I get it extra clean on the interior, but so far it looks really good. Only got a couple stains, but again, if you need anything, call us at 513-420-0000 or check out our website at superlowmiles.com. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.